Welcome everybody to Live Case Break. This is Larry. We're doing a Leaf Rookie Retro Box for Andrew C. This just came out this week, so let's see how it is. I think this is worth more than the box. I'm not positive, but I'm pretty sure it is. You'll you'll like it regardless. I only put the the Leaf original is Joe Mixon. Not positive, but I'm pretty sure it is. You'll, you'll like it regardless. You can kind of see what it is. <laughs> Behind it. Leaf original is still mixed. You can kind of see what it is. Behind it. I'm pretty sure that goes for good money. Patterson 9. I think it goes for more than 200 bucks or 250 bucks or whatever it is. I'm pretty sure that goes I could be wrong. I could be wrong. Yeah, I do. I'm looking now. Yeah, bro. Way over box price. 450, 315, 320, 328, 309, 329. So we did good. Way over box price. 450, 315, 320, 329, 329. So we did good. Yeah, we did good. We did not lose. <laughs> that was a W. Yeah, we did good. We did not lose. Yeah, we did good. We did not lose. <laughs> that was a W. Okay, you got it. Now, Andrew, I had him upside down before. So the top box would have been this, the way I had it before. Okay. So do you want... Now, Andrew, I had it Which one do you want? Do you want the top the way I had it before or the top actual this, top? The way I had it before. So do you want... Which one do you want? Do you want the top the way I had it before or the top actual top? Top from before, which would be the bottom. Okay, here we go. Another box. This is a winner too. This is a winner also, dude. All right, you're starting off. You have a Mike Williams out of 25 blue. This is a winner too. This is a winner also, dude. I'm almost sure this is worth more than the box price and then we have tops chrome lebron rookie nine let me look it up for you i'm pretty sure it's worth more also yeah bro 390 350, yeah, 350. Yeah, winner again. Double winner. <laughs> 350, 350. Yeah, winner again. Double winner. Too bad it wasn't a refractor, right? Too bad it wasn't a refractor, right? Alright, here we go. Good luck, man. I hate when they do this. It's not a bad card, but it's great at 8-5. I just don't think they should have 8-5s in these buybacks, but it's a good card. Especially after today. Okay, this is Tatis. 5 out of 5. Probably is decent. And then your buyback is Prescott out of 99, Kramer's Choice from Preferred. But graded 8-5. And then your buyback is Prescott out of 99, Kramer's Choice from Preferred. But graded 8-5. The grade of the edge is 8. I think that deserves a bump, but I think it's off-center. So, And they gave the centering a 9.5, and it's clearly off-center. Look at the sides of the thing. 
I think that deserves a bump, but I think it's off center. So I gave the centering a nine five, and it's clearly cool off card. I'll look it up. Hold on. Hold on. Yeah, that's not good. And it ends all over the place. One ended for 160, one ended for 90. That's not good. And it ends all over the place. One ended for 160, one ended for 90. I think his stuff is going to start to go up, though. He's playing good, so... I wouldn't sell that one yet, but it's up to you. I think he's a buy right now, not a sell. All right, let's see what's in the other one. That was a that was an L. We took an L on that one. I don't know what this is worth. I gotta look it up. It could be good. Very good grade. I don't know what this is worth. And these are super marketable because everybody's making these sets. Here's Nolan Patrick. He's selling right now. Well, not that at 25. And these are super marketable because everybody's making these sets. And then you got this. These sell well because everybody's always buying these. I don't know what it goes for though. A keen rookie BGS nine. So let's look. And then you got this. These sell well because everybody's always buying. Them. I don't know what it goes for though. A keen rookie BGS nine. So let's look. Nah, dog shit. Hundred bucks. Which kind of sucks because that is a tough card to get in good shape. Hundred bucks. Nah. What's it as a PSA? I wonder. If you rehold it. PSA, it's worth double, dude. 172, 164, 132. On the top end, this is worth more as a reholder, but I wouldn't. It's got edge issues. I don't know that you would get better. On the top end, this is worth more as a reholder, but I wouldn't. It's got edge issues. I don't know that you would get better. And it's off center. I think they were generous giving this a nine, to be honest. Look at the left right. The left right on the front is about 60 40, but on the back it's awful. Like 70 30, or maybe maybe 75 25. People are always making these sets though, so it sells pretty easily. We should have stopped after two boxes, I think. Let me know what you want me to send to you and what you want to what you want me to send to Tim. I would hold the daft for a little bit. My opinion, but up to you, obviously. I would hold the daft for a little bit. My no, I wouldn't. I would not. I'll send it to him and ask him if he thinks we should be holding it. But I'm telling you, and looking at it, I wouldn't. I would leave it alone. I don't think we're gonna get a better PSA grade. It's got problems. This card. They gave it nine centering. There's no way it's a nine. Even top to bottom, it's slightly off. And PSA is way more strict. So we can, this could go from from a hundred to hundred and fifty, you know, hundred to hundred fifty dollar card down to like a sixty dollar card real easily. I will leave it be. So we can, this could go from from a hundred to. And you know, I I almost never give you an opinion on these things. I always say, ask him. I will leave it be. With vintage though, I'm I have a little bit more experience than he does, because I collect all that crap, you know. I always say, ask him. With vintage though, I'm I have a little bit more experience than he does. You're gonna sell the DAC? I guess price it high. I will. The LeBron is beautiful. I guess price it high. I will. Let me write on them all. The LeBron is beautiful. Save the video.